When it comes to rules, regulations, laws, all of that stuff, um, I come down to the basic of what Jesus said. Love one another as I've loved you. So all the rules, regulations, protocols, to me, they're, they're non-relational and God doesn't operate within that relationally. Does he want to guide? Does he want to help? Does he want to give you insight, revelation? Yes, he does. Will he help you uh, to walk with him on the journey? Yes, he will. But he's not going to do it by tying you to him, restricting you, controlling you. He's going to encourage you. So, yes, creativity has within it some things that can be helpful for you to be able to learn to do but not in a restrictive way because they've got to be done through who you are. So you can't do things the way I do them because you're not me. But you can learn to do things the way you can do them because you're you. So in that sense, you're not really being a hypocrite because rules of music are not rules to restrict you. They're creative opportunities for you to develop something that you can share with other people. You see, if you didn't have the notes of music that you could write down, then you couldn't share those so someone else could play the same thing. You could record what you're doing so they could listen to it. But actually, this helps other people to be able to maybe play the song that you're writing in a way through they. And they, of course, can, uh, can also add their bits to it. Um, so it's always creative. So there aren't, I don't follow like, you know, Ian and Dr. O and people like that with their sort of regimented Nazi parade i can i can understand what you're saying there because bottom line is i don't function protocolly i don't go into heaven and have to do do it this way or do that way or do the other yeah there are some things i've learned that work but they work because they're designed to help me do something not restrict me in doing it so when i learned to legislate i learned to engage where I could legislate then I learned to engage getting that authorized and then it got written into those statutes and I learned all that but it doesn't restrict me it helps me because it helps me follow a way of getting what I've done into function but it doesn't restrict me in that I see it as something there to guide or help me but it's not prescriptive in the I can only do it one way because I've also engaged in things and there's been an instant connection to something i've done legislatively and i didn't need to go through that process so god sometimes just shakes up the system so that you don't get caught in it so you don't get caught well if i do this this will happen because that is cause and effect that's not relationship god wants you to enjoy relationship with him so he can help you be who you are who he created you to be so you're not stuck um trying to do it yourself or trying to work it out yourself so i don't believe that there are rules regulations or protocols in a restrictive way i believe there's guidance and guidelines and principles that we can apply in our situation and circumstances to outwork us being us Therefore, you don't need a protocol of saying 50 this or 50 that or doing that for this to work. That's not a relational way. Then you'll just make it try and make it work because, well, that's the rule. Actually, what God says, walk with me every day, sit close to me and we'll 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 get to the right place. You'll learn what you need to learn along the way because you're going to be close to me. And he wants relationship not rules and regulations and protocols so i don't think protocol when i engage with god i think relationship i'm only going to do what i see the father doing therefore he's going to show me what he's doing one way or another and if he doesn't show me anything then i'm just going to continue enjoy being you know with him so it's a much more rest relaxing way of living because we're not driven to perform or keep to some rules or regulations what he does he has a way of righteousness which is a way of blessing so that i will be blessed and other people will be blessed and that's just love in action unconditional love in action because that is the basis of everything loving being loved unconditionally by a loving father by jesus 
and also loving others unconditionally as well. So I'm not going to put protocols or rules or regulations on other people because God doesn't put them on me because he loves me. He loves me too much to control me or to try and regulate me in a restrictive way. He wants me to grow and increase. There's no end to the increase of his government and peace. So enjoy growing and maturing and ascending into who you really are just by relationally following him and enjoying his presence rather than trying to do it by some strict protocol. I've got to do this, got to do this in this order. If I get it wrong, it ain't going to work. That's not how God is. He wants to bless you. He doesn't want to tie you up in rules and regulations and red tape and protocol. He is not a bureaucrat. He's a dad and he wants us to enjoy being with him. If you enjoy these videos, would you please take a moment to like, comment and subscribe? It really does help. Thank you very much.